ओम शांति थर्ड अक्टूबर 2022 इंग्लिश मुरली एसेंस स्वीट चिल्ड्रन यू आर स्पिरिचुअल वॉरियर्स यू हैव रिसीव्ड वेरी बिग बॉम्ब्स ऑफ नॉलेज विद व्हिच यू हैव टू कॉन्कर माया द एनिमी क्वेश्चन बाय अंडरस्टैंडिंग व्हिच सीक्रेट हैव यू बिकम केयरफुली एम्प्रर्स आंसर by understanding the secret of the whole drama you have become carefree emperors you know that you are now settling your old karmic accounts and filling your aprons with knowledge and yoga for 21 births you are shiv baba's grandchildren and the children of brahma baba so what is there for you to worry about today's song Om shanti the father sits here and explains my beloved children you are an incognito army you children have received explosives and also very big bombs of knowledge you know that this is the same episode of the gita that is the same part of the drama is being played once again it is only the gita scripture that has a connection with the mahabharat war you children are an incognito army those people are trying to refine the bombs similarly shri baba says i am also giving you very good bombs of knowledge through brahma therefore blow the conch shell at human beings and tell them clearly that the part of the gita is being enacted once again and that the heavenly deity kingdom is being established you children are establishing a kingdom for yourselves that army makes effort for their king and queen you are conquering maya for yourselves and claiming the sovereignty for 21 births exactly as you did 5000 years ago it is in your intellects that you really are making your fortune those people receive big salaries for a short time here each of you is creating your reward for 21 births you could even go higher than mama and baba but the conscience says that no one can go higher than mama and baba although the sun and moon become eclipsed they cannot break up stars break up baba says my beloved children why would i not remember you children why would i not remember my beloved long lost and now found children however experience says that children forget to remember the father by considering yourselves to be his children rather than his brides you will receive more power because a bride is only a half partner of a bridegroom whereas you children are full heirs of the father this is why baba says i love knowledgeable souls trans messengers want to have visions those who continue to say baba baba throughout the whole day would be called knowledgeable baba has a very deep interest in knowledge the bombs of knowledge that you are receiving are something new many people receive visions etc in trance but they don't receive any knowledge baba doesn't say that trance is bad on the path of devotion when people have visions they become happy but they can't go to the land of liberation by receiving those baba says you are going to come to my land you know that through this knowledge you will become future princes deities do not exist here for you to see 
with your eyes, though there are their images. You can see Krishna. The dances of the princes and princesses take place there. That is, the divine activities of the children are portrayed. However, they don't know when they will become empresses or when they will meet their princes. Baba gives you visions so that you have the faith that you are to become future empresses. You can also understand through knowledge that your souls and your bodies will both be pure there. The mantra of Hamso applies to this time. By remembering Shri Baba, you receive strength. They show a game of putting a bead in your mouth. When you put a bead in your mouth, Maya flies away. Baba himself says, O oh, beloved children, do all your work, but simply keep the Father in your intellects. Your pilgrimage is to only the one supreme abode. When those people go on pilgrimages, they wander around a great deal. They have all the four places in their intellects. You have just the one supreme abode in your intellects. Ask anyone. What do you want? He would say liberation. Sannyasis renounce their homes and families because they want peace. They go to the forests thinking that they will become free from the cycle of birth and death and also receive eternal liberation. However, no one can become free for all time. The drama is eternally predestined. No one knows the secrets of this drama. They don't know the creator, director or principal actor. You know that there are four equal parts of the drama. It isn't that the duration of the golden age is longer. When they cook rice in a pot in Jagannath Puri, it automatically divides into four equal parts. This world is a drama of four ages. You know its beginning, middle and end. This is a play. We did is used to rule the kingdom and then we lost it. We are now regaining it again. It is a matter of 5,000 years. Here each one makes effort for the self. To the extent that you make others equal to yourself, accordingly Baba will give you a prize. Baba says your sins will automatically be absolved with the fire of yoga. I don't do anything. You are attaining the kingdom through your own efforts. There is the example of King Janak. That is called a vision. You know that you are making effort to go into liberation in life and that it requires knowledge. We are not going to stay in liberation. We have all round parts. When you travel by train, you go via Ahmedabad. We have to go to the land of liberation in life via liberation. Repeatedly remember the supreme abode. Students study at those schools for four or five hours. You cannot study that much here. This is why you are told to study for an hour or half an hour. Amritvela is good for this. You also bathe at Amritvela. Listen to the Murli once and then continue to repeat those points. The Murli is recorded on tape. Even if you listen to it after 15 days, you will become refreshed. You would instantly think about the points you had not noted before. It is good to keep your Murli notes with you. These are explosives. Many children keep notes just as barristers and surgeons keep many books with them. Those who have studied many books give good medicine. Some take notes very well. Others can't even take notes. Baba would say, that too is your karmic bondage. It is also because of your sins. You children know that your kingdom is being established. Initially, the British came here as merchants, but while doing business, they saw that the people here were fighting among themselves. So they decided to build their own army 
and take over those kingdoms. This is very easy for you. There is no question of killing anyone. You are claiming your fortune of a kingdom with the power of yoga. From where did Lakshmi and Narayan receive their kingdom in the golden age? The night of the iron age has to end and the day the golden age has to come. During the day, there is the kingdom and during the night, there is chaos. When Baba comes, we belong to the Lord and Master. After the Iron Age, there is the Golden Age. After innumerable religions, there is just the one religion. Those who claimed the kingdom in the previous cycle are claiming it now. That is called the Heavenly Deity Kingdom. It is now Hell. The land of Nirvana is Brahmand where you live in the form of an egg. You have the knowledge of Brahmand and the whole world in your intellects. These are such easy things. The main thing is about the Gita. They have changed God's name in the Gita. These are bombs of knowledge. Explain one thing tactfully. At this time, all are trapped in the quicksand. Baba comes and enables you to make spiritual endeavor in order for you to be removed from the quicksand. Maya has broken your wings. You are unable to fly. Everyone now has to become pure and return home. You are making effort to claim your fortune of the kingdom from Baba once again. The father explains, you should remain happy. Those who continue to imbibe knowledge very well and make others equal to themselves will return very happy. Those who pass with number one will definitely be happy. Even the government gives scholarships. Your rosary is also created. There is the rosary of 108 and also of 16,108. They put that in a box. You have now understood whose rosary that is and what the rosary of Rudraksh in brackets with faces on the beads is. First is the rosary of Brahma. The father is creating creation. Those who climb into the heart of Brahma will climb into heart of Shibaba. This is the rosary of Brahma. All of you are children and so First is his rosary and then there is the rosary of Rudra. You will then be threaded around the neck of Vishnu. That heavenly kingdom is now being established. This human world becomes heaven and hell. Gods and goddesses reside in heaven. That is called heaven. Those who are in heaven then go to hell. From being in hell we then go to heaven. We conquer Maya and become conquerors of the world. You would say that you have played these parts innumerable times. Some people ask, is it just you who are going to see heaven? Will we not see heaven? Tell them, not everyone can go there. That's impossible. Each one continues to play his part of the Sato, Rajo and Tamo stages. No one knows this. You know that our kingdom is being established. We are becoming the masters of heaven. The drama will definitely inspire you to make effort. According to the drama, he conducts the Murli through this one. You won't be able to stay without making effort. You won't just sit down and remain idle. Just as the Murli was conducted in the previous cycle, so it will be conducted in the same way now, according to the drama. These are such deep matters. The drama definitely has to repeat. You are carefree emperors. You are the grandchildren of the Supreme Father, the Supreme Soul. What concern would you have? This is Raj Yoga. Baba says, finish your old karmic accounts. Remove your intellect's yoga from them. Then, the more you accumulate through knowledge and yoga, the more your aprons will continue to be filled for 
21 births. There is no question of being afraid in this. Baba is the one who gives. He says, whatever you have, surrender it. You are not going to build palaces here. What would you do with that money? You simply take three square feet of land and open a center. This is a very big university and hospital. There are many of those hospitals, but only one hospital of this kind. Those who are religious minded would say, why should we not open such a hospital where people can become ever healthy? Baba gives health and wealth. And so they say, Baba, this is yours. You can use it as you want. Have faith and follow him completely. Everyone makes those of his own caste go ahead. You say that you are Brahmins. And so why should you not transfer everything? Baba is giving you the sovereignty for 21 births. By occupying yourself in doing Baba's service, you will never starve to death. We don't have any expenses. You simply eat two chapatis for your stomach. What else is there? People have so many expenses. They spend so much on weddings, etc. We don't have any expenses. You are engaged to Shibaba. You don't have expenses of even a few pennies. You become engaged and then go to Baba. Your children have to do service here too. You would be happy on seeing your memorial. This is the memorial of our Baba and Mama. There are also memorials of our deities. There are five to seven main memorials and the first main one is that of Shri Baba. That one has many names. Then there are the memorials of Brahma, Vishnu and Shankar of the subtle region. Then in the human world at the confluence age, there are Jagadamba and Jagatpita and you Shaktis, the children. Then in the golden age, there are just Lakshmi and Narayan. Many types of temples have been built. There is so much wandering around there. You have become free from all of those things and so you remain happy. There is no other university where human beings change into deities. Yours is a godly student life. You will pass and then be transferred. Acha, To the sweetest, beloved, long lost and now found children. Love, remembrance and good morning from the mother, the father. Bab Dada. The spiritual father says Namaste to the spiritual children. The spiritual children extend their love, remembrance, say good morning, Namaste and thank you to the spiritual Bab Dada. Essence for Dharana. First point. Listen to the Murli at Amritwela and then repeat the points. Definitely take notes from the Murli. In order to remain happy, do the service of making others equal to yourself. Number two, in order to climb into Father Brahma's heart, become powerful in knowledge and yoga. Pass with number one and claim a scholarship. Blessing. May you consider any problem in the drama to be part of the play and play your part accurately as a hero actor. Explanation A hero actor is one who doesn't act ordinarily. He acts every part accurately. No matter how many problems there are, what the circumstances may be, he is not dependent on any of those. Because of having all rights, he overcomes them all in such a way that it is as though he is overcoming everything in a play. There is always happiness in a play. No matter what the play is, even if he has a part of crying externally, he is aware internally that all of it is an unlimited play. By your considering this to be a play, even a big problem becomes light. Slogan Those who are constantly happy are worthy of being praised. Om Shanti